everybody, I am so excited because fall is one of my favorite times of year. I've just started decorating. I found this really cute truck, like last year sometime, so cute. And Jace surprised me with these cinnamon smelling pine cones, even though it's kind of Christmassy, I love it too. I love all things from like September to the end of the year. I love fall, I love doing so many cool things with the holidays and I'm really excited to share today we're gonna be doing fall crafts that are super easy for kids. Let's get started. Craft number one is super cute. It is taking rocks that you have in your yard and turning them into fun fall decorations. First item is rocks or round pebbles that you can find in the garden or in the side of your yard. Second, you're gonna need basic supplies, something to paint on, paper plates, paint brushes, acrylic paint, some water, and a paper towel. This craft is really simple and fun. Make sure you wash your rocks first, and then you can paint any image on the front of the rock. We like to give the kids ideas, pictures of pumpkins, or fall activities, or leaves, whatever you would like, and then they can paint their own decorations so that you can have a fun rock decor that you can put somewhere in your house. I am painting a pumpkin patch. I painted a leaf and then a pumpkin. Even the teenager likes our arts and crafts activity. Let's see. Oh, look at that fall that tree. Very pretty, Raquel. All right, our second activity we're gonna be doing is a leaf paint mural. I'm really excited. I used to do this as a kid. First item you're gonna need is leaves. Go ahead and gather leaves wherever you can. If you have trees in your yard, um, go down to the park and just gather all different shapes and sizes of leaves. Second item, you're gonna need cardstock, then some paint brushes, different paint colors, and of course, a clean workstation. So water, paper towels, paper plates, and all of your basic paint supplies. First you're gonna get your fall paper color and then you're gonna pick out your leaf. Cora has chosen this leaf and you're gonna just paint. You're gonna paint all one side of the leaf. Make sure to get those edges so we can see the shape of the leaf. And then you're gonna press the leaf onto your paper, construction paper. Press it down. Let's see. Oh, beautiful. As you have different leaves, you're gonna get different colors, and you can have an array of any kind of colors and shape. And if you have one type of leaf, you can paint a different type of leaf, change out the leaves left and right, so you can have a beautiful leaf paint mural by the time that you're done. And it is super simple and fun, but just remember this one gets a little messy because they're gonna be touching more and more paint, so make sure that you are properly dressed, you have some aprons or junky clothes so that if you do get paint on you or around, it's an easy cleanup. Mommy, it looks like coral. Those are the veins, and that's how the tree sends the nutrients to the leaves. All right, our next project is going to be a fall pendant banner, which is gonna be really easy. And what you're gonna need is, you're gonna need foam colors. These are foam sheets, and you're gonna need colors of whatever your choice. So we chose red, yellow, and orange. Um, you're gonna need some scissors, a hole punch, and some string. Okay, so for our third craft, we are gonna make the pendant banner. So we've got this triangle that we're going to use to trace and then cut it out. So first, we get any color foam that you want. You get the triangle. So you put the triangle down, then you, then you trace it with a Sharpie marker or pencil. Traced it, and now we get the scissors and we cut it out. Once you've cut it, you will need a hole puncher, and you punch two holes into the triangle, and then you can put the string through it, but first, if you want to spell out anything, you get a sharpier marker again, and you write on the front a letter of it. For this one, we're making a fall um, pendant banner, so I'm putting an F on this orange one. Okay, so this first pet banner is done. Okay guys, since we couldn't find another hole puncher, if you don't have a hole puncher, you can just use scissors, fold the paper in half, and cut where you want your hole to be, and then you've got a hole. So we're going to cut another hole. 
then we're going to get a lot of rope and we string it in, but you don't cut it yet because you want to know how much string you need and you don't want to cut it too small or too long. And you just put the string through it like that. And then once you've gotten all your triangles or any shapes you like done, then you'll put it on the string and you can hang it up wherever you like. So we are almost done. So our pattern's gonna be red, red yellow, yellow, orange, yellow, red. orange, red. Oh yeah, yeah. So we're almost done. We've just been tracing these triangles and cutting the holes. And soon we're going to have a pendant banner. triangles, we are going to put the string through it, then draw the letters. So on the triangles before the, the letters that you're doing, you can draw like what your theme is. Like ours is fall, so where I'm doing a leaf and she's doing a pumpkin. So that's just extra decoration if you want. Okay, so we've got everything done. Cora's just drawing her pumpkin. Very good. And okay, so now we're going to show you our thing. And here it says, Fall. And that is the third craft, the pendant banner. Okay. Fall. Autumn. So what happens if you fall into autumn? <laughs> Is that a good dad joke? It is. All right, we just finished our third craft. The girls did such a good pendant banner. So cute. And I put these rocks right here to be part of our little decorations. All right, we had fun doing our crafts. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. We have many more to come. So if you guys want to check out a huge roundup of lots and lots of easy fall crafts you can do with your children, go over to theyohannaventure.com, check on the blog, and we'll have a huge list of fun, easy fall crafts that the girls or your kids can do by themselves or can do with you your help. It's been lots of fun, and guess what? We're gonna get decorating for fall. Are you guys ready? Yeah! All right, thanks for hanging out, everybody. I'm Rachel Bennett. We'll check you guys next time on The Now Mom. Bye! Bye.